Hello everybody, so my name's Sydney and I am making this video because tomorrow all this hair is going to be chopped off and I am going pixie. I don't care what anyone else thinks, I'm just doing it. And a lot of people ask me why or why your hair is so pretty why would you want it short and honestly i am just so done with long hair it is a long time needed this pixie cut i mean it's just so tangly all the time and it takes forever to shower and it takes forever to blow dry and i just said you know what i want to make my life a whole lot easier so anyway, I decided I wanted to make a video series kind of thing about my journey with the pixie cut. And obviously this is the before. And I'm hopefully going to donate it. I'm not sure if I'm allowed to because my ends are dyed. But I've donated my hair three times before, but I've never gone pixie. So I'm super excited about that. Um, so if... The length is kind of hard to tell right now because it's wavy because I slept on it wet last night. <laughs> but, um, I don't know if you can see. Hopefully you can see. But it's like, it's about mid-back. So it's pretty long. And, um, so yeah, I'm really, really excited. And these are the two pictures I'm going to be showing my hairdressing. This is how I kind of want the side and the back to look. Kind of sh super short. And then I love Jennifer Goodwin's hair in the front. I just love the bangs. And hopefully I'll have a whole lot of fun styling that. And in future videos, I'll be able to make videos about that as well. If I decide I don't like the bangs... Because I've had bangs before, and I just find them super annoying. They get in your eyes, and then, I don't know, I just didn't want to have to deal with them. I might go for a shorter bang. But I guess we'll find out tomorrow. I'm super excited, and I hope to, at least, I hope... Everything's going to turn out good, well. And then in the future, I think I'm going to make videos of styling my hair. And you guys can ask me as many questions as you want. Obviously, I don't really know anything right now because I haven't gotten it yet. But hopefully in the later videos, I'll be able to answer some of your questions. And maybe inspire some of you to get the pixie cut. Um, if all goes well. So, I guess for now, it's until then. And the next time you see me... I'm going to have a pixie cut. Bye, guys. Okay. Hey. Sydney thinks she needs a whole new wardrobe now. <laughs> Short hair? She said, she goes, I can't wear my free people hippie stuff anymore. <laughs> it definitely makes you feel like you always have to be made up also. When it, I, I don't know, that's how I felt when I cut all my hair off. No, but like all my clothes are like hippie. Yeah. She's going to wear a t-shirt. She's going to look like a boy. <laughs> no. Well, you and Jack will be twins. <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> now we'll officially So you're doing a point touch? Yeah, I'm texturizing it.
was, I don't remember. I have the picture. That's the only way I know. But ever since then, Dad was asking me to do that again. Sydney had long curls when she was born. And she was born five weeks early. She had long curls when she was born. Longer than this? Longer than that, yeah, for sure. And it was black. Remember, Mom? Yep. Pretty much. We definitely want to come in and do the front first. And it was goes out a little more, okay? So you see, like, individual. Okay. The size, you want to make it as flat as possible. You don't want, like, a mushroom. Poofy, poofy sides, okay? You want to keep those in, so just brush them straight down. The only place you want volume is right at your crown. And then we said we're going this way. So, I will take this thing and kind of push your legs up that way. Wait till you see her face. You, so you saw what I did, right? Like once you have it through your hands, you want to get it through the whole head. And then you just kind of, you know, make it your own. What do you think about these veins? Are they short enough? Yeah. Hey guys, so today I got my pixie cut and I am so happy. Like, I can't even deal with how much I like it. It's like so cute. I mean, I was inspired by Jennifer Goodwin and I think my hair looks pretty darn close to hers. And oh my god, it was the best experience of my life so if any of you have the chance to get a pixie cut I definitely recommend it because first of all let's just talk about the weight difference because my hair used to be so heavy and now it is like I feel bald I'm not even kidding I feel like I have nothing on my head and it is such a relief let me tell you and today it was so hot and my friend with long hair was complaining about how hot it was. And then I went outside and I was like, I'm not hot. I'm, it's actually like a breeze. I can feel breeze on my neck. And it was the strangest feeling I think I've ever felt. But anyway, so the cut, I donated my, I wound up being able to donate my hair, even though it was dyed. Cause, and so... I'm really happy about that. So this is the front, and I decided to do bangs, and I decided to go with the longer ones, and I think it turned out pretty darn well. And I can style these however I want. She put the styling putty in it. I can't remember what it's called, but the next video, I promise, I will show you all my styling products that I wind up with using. So this is the front, and I really like it. And the styling putty makes it so easy to like manipulate. You can basically play with it all day and then it'll be fine. And even if you mess it up, you can put it right back to where it was. I mean, I'm not going to try it because I'm new at this. 
and I'm not sure if I'll be able to put it back right away. So I'm not going to try it on camera, but right after this, oh my god, I'm going to have so much fun. So this is the front, and then this is the side, and this is the other side, and then the back is super short. So this is the vest, and she actually used one of the buzzers. It felt so weird at, when she used that thing. I was scared. I had no idea what that thing was, but it turned out so good, and I am so happy with it. And if you guys have any questions about it, about, like, what was it like getting the haircut, or how the haircut feels, or anything you want to ask me, just ask me in the comments, or inbox me, or whatever you want, and I'll answer all the questions in the next video. And, um, also... Also, I am just so excited to see what I can do with it because it just seems so fun and I am just so happy. And so I hope you guys like it as much as I do because I just, I love it. I love it so much. And then I was, I forgot what I was going to say about, um... Oh, I actually got my mom to videotape me getting the haircut. So, are you guys interested in seeing that? I don't really know. So, please let me know down in the comments if you would want to see that video. Um, I mean, it's kind of long and it might be kind of boring. Um, obviously, my reaction is not boring. It's actually kind of funny. But... Again, if you have any questions, let me know, and don't forget to comment and subscribe and all that jazz because I love, I would love to share my journey with you. So, bye guys, until next time.